to get started, you're going to need a red and a white worsted weight yarn and a 5mm crochet hook. Start with a slip knot and a chain of 7. After that, you're going to begin in the second chain from the hook and make a half double crochet. And then you're going to put one half double crochet in every chain down the row. Also, if you like videos like this, be sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe so I can continue making great content. Alright, to begin your next row, chain one and turn your work. Beginning in the first stitch, make a half double crochet, and then make one half double crochet in every stitch. After this row, you're going to do this same thing for two more rows, so you'll have four rows by the end of your project. That's it, so you can cut your yarn and fasten off, and now we're going to make the little triangle inside of it. You're going to start with a slip knot and a chain of four. After that, you're going to start in the second chain from the hook and make a single crochet. Then you're going to make one single crochet in the last two chains. Begin your next row, chain one, and turn your work. Beginning over the first two stitches, you're going to make a single crochet decrease, so a single crochet two together over the first two stitches. Then you're going to single crochet into the last stitch. Then you're going to chain one, turn your work, and beginning in the first stitch, make a single crochet two together once. Then chain one, turn your work. And I'm going to put one more single crochet in that first, the only stitch you have. So the single crochet two together, you're just going to put one single crochet into there. Then you can cut your yarn and fasten off. And then you need to sew your triangle to your red square. And then I felt to make it look a little bit neater, I would do a single crochet board around the entire thing. So essentially, I just put one single crochet in every space, and then in the corners I did three. So repeat that all the way around and then slip stitch to the beginning stitch. Just weave in your ends and cut them off and that's it. I hope you had fun and I will see you next time.